Today we're making Eggs Benedict. This is an easy version that anyone can make at home. We'll start with the hollandaise sauce. Get a couple of egg yolks into a bowl, whisk them up. While you're doing that, we'll melt a knob of butter in the microwave. Place your sauce bowl on top of a pot of simmering water. Make sure you keep whisking as you go. Add your melted butter, add a dash of vinegar, some salt and some pepper. Keep whisking it as you go. Add a squeeze of lemon juice for a sharp taste. Add a drop of water and it's almost ready. Now that's thickened up, we'll take it off the heat. Add your remaining butter into a frying pan. Add a drizzle of olive oil to your English muffins and a little bit of salt and pepper. We're gonna place these in face down into the frying pan. Flip them over once they've gone brown on top and toast the bottom of the muffin. Once the muffins are finished toasting, place them on the plates, ready to start assembly. Toss the spinach into the same pan. We're using spinach, so it's gonna be a mix of eggs Benedict and eggs Florentine today. Season the spinach with some olive oil, some salt and pepper, and also a squeeze of lemon juice. Give the spinach a quick toss for a matter of seconds while it's in the pan, and it will quickly wilt. You can put the spinach straight onto the muffins. Bring the water back to simmering, add a dash of vinegar and a pinch of salt. I find it quite difficult to poach an egg, but we're going with the swirly method, so I'm gonna swirl the water around and drop each egg in individually. Today we're using ham, you can use bacon, you can use salmon, you can use mushrooms, you can use whatever you want, but ham's always a tasty selection. We're gonna serve the eggs with a slotted spoon so we can drain some of the water off. If the hollandaise is a bit thick, you can add a dash of water and whisk it in. Drizzle the hollandaise sauce over the eggs to complete this delicious morsel. So that's how you make a quick and easy Eggs Benedict. I reckon anyone can make this at home and I hope you enjoyed watching that video. Cheers.